six women, one goal. Extreme Huntress. Extreme Huntress is brought to you by these proud sponsors. Today we went for the Corsican Ram and before I got here I had a plan. First time I've really had an opportunity to hunt with Candace. Today before we started the hunt I wanted to sit down with her a little bit and learn a little bit more about her and maybe even ask her how did you hunt the first time you went out? The first day I was hunting like I would in BC and it was very yeah. quiet. Yeah, here you almost have to hunt a little bit more aggressively yeah. because we have a very limited amount of time to cover a lot of territory. Yeah. In this corner there's a small pond and then Pretty much in center between east and west and north and south, there's a, a larger pond that holds water throughout the year. This is kind of a seasonal pond. Chances are if you see one, there'll be more than one there. Mm -hmm. Very seldom see just one. I got into hunting when I was really young. It was our way of life. That's how my mom and dad raised me and my brother. Let's just go. Is it really loud in there? I think it'd be okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's do that. Right away, we saw two beautiful Corsican rams. Chantel, she's been awesome. Like, she's such an awesome hunting partner. Anything she saw, she let me know. As it worked out, it seemed like they hunted very well together, but Candace had a pretty good game plan in mind. She knew where the water was. She knew where the ridges were. She knew where there were open areas. <laughs> the south, it started easing up, got to a, a, a point to where you kind of teed to where you had to make a decision whether you go left or right. We ended up just about turning left and Chantel, she just happened to see one on, on the right side and we were going to go left. There's a brown right there. Right there. Right there. so fortunate. Candace played the wind absolutely perfectly. She played the sun absolutely perfectly. And uh, kind of eased up very close, got a little bit closer, got a little bit closer. Two of them were facing away from us, so we couldn't see their their horns, so we weren't sure. But we set up. It was about, I don't know, like maybe 50 yard shot, if, if that. And we set up and we got the confirmation that it was the bull that we were looking for. That's awesome! Oh, oh my god, he's down. Holy shit. He's like, Do I, I keep a bullet in it, right? Keep one in, the, not in the chamber, but in the mag. Yeah, keep it in the magazine. It's down, hang on. He's a big high fiver. He's laying right there. He's yeah. Over well, let's go see him. <laughs> Throughout all this, Candace maintained her composure extremely well until after she pulled the trigger. It was really interesting and, and rewarding in a lot of different ways to see how excited she was, how genuinely excited she was about this, but also how she felt, you could tell, she felt somewhat sad about the fact of taking an animal's life. <laughs> oh my God. I've got the most amazing animal. I've never seen an animal like that before. I'm so excited and uh, yeah, it's like he's beautiful. 
watching where she was pointing the gun all the way throughout. Even at that moment, that gun was always pointing in a very, very safe direction. The hand was away from the trigger, except for when she pulled the trigger. Guide places it on his hat, presents it to you, or actually it's presented like this, so it's pointed to you with vitamins high out. And the response is vitamins dunk, and then you put it in your hat or cap, and you wear it for 24 hours on the right side and show a respect for the animal and for the great sport of hunting. Vitamins donk. <laughs> like there. You're a great hunting partner. Thank you. So you, you totally are. To have that kind of enthusiasm about hunting, but also to have a hunting partner that where you work very closely together, and I compliment both these ladies. Two very great pluses when it comes to hunting in the outdoors. Next time on Extreme Huntress, it's our third skills challenge of the competition. Long range shooting, brought to you by Thompson Long Range. Who's got what it takes to be 2017's Extreme Huntress? Tune in and find out. Extreme Huntress is brought to you by these proud sponsors.